I'm Tom and this is Will and we're from Lapan. I'm Zeb, I'm from Greyjax. Well, I'm Dan and I play tall relatives. <laughs> that would be I'm Stevie, I am the lead guitarist of French Weather. Good evening viewers, I'm Jaime from the Gerties. Hey, I'm Rui from the Gerties. Hey, my name is Serena, you might have seen me off Tinder. Uh, I'm a drama. I'm here to perform at Jackson's Little Shindig, Little Backyard Festival. I'm Jackson, and I did I did this because I just wanted to. It was sort of like an idea for like a really long time, and I wanted the experience in in like organizing everything. And like I don't know, ultimately just wanted to bring people together, have a good time, have some fun. I just think it'll be such a new experience playing in front of different sort of people. I'd like I couldn't see this kind of crowd at a at a bar. Yeah, it's way it's way more intimate as well. Like you can really kind of like rock out without the fear of like Seko grabbing you out and pushing you out of the mosh for doing nothing. So it's pretty nice. Oh, just the vibe. Just get pissed and have a good time. It's way more relaxed, definitely. It's free beer for the band, so like I was like, nah, no, no fucking way. I'm saying no. Everyone just loves us around here. Everybody's just totally vibing. So vibing. We're all riding the vibe, man. Don't know about you ladies. All the Sheilas out here are vibing, man. It's sick. It's cool, man. If you're playing to your friends, there's no reason to get nervous at all. So if you're very shy, and a lot of people here are, <laughs> that's a good way to start for sure. You got a place to sleep after you get fucked up. <laughs> nah. Just kidding. I think backyard gigs are, are pretty important. More, mostly, I wouldn't say more for bands, I'd say mostly for for like people, like everyone in a whole. We're from the Peninsula and there's not there's probably like one good venue down there. So like we kind of played a few house parties and like it's really good to meet with other bands from different places and you, I don't know, it's really nice to connect with people. It just feels a lot less formal. It's harder to get gigs in Melbourne because there's so many great bands. There's a lot of competition, so if you just put them on yourself, you can sort out the lineup and do it all on your own. So it's more yeah. fun as well. And you know everyone's going to watch. Yeah. So I do love a gig in Melbourne at a bar, but I find that these ones are a bit more close-knit and you can kind of have a bit more of a chat to people as the day goes on. People are, are more likely to get around a, a band that they hear at a venue such as this. Just heaps of mates doing the same thing that you're doing, it's just all good to come together and yeah, it's great, you know, sometimes you know, being in a band, you're always you know, practicing your instrument in your room, it's just good to come out, play in front of everyone, I think it's really good. The biggest highlight, probably just the fact that I, it actually worked. Um, I was so surprised and so happy with how everything played out. This is just a lot of fun. I mean, there's no pressure to be really good, and there's no pressure to like, like really impress anyone. Like, it's it's takes that all out, and it just makes it a lot more enjoyable. 